rape crisis opposed the amendment and stood against survivors to not allow men to be discriminated against. What sort of men do we think want to work as a rape trauma medical examiner? Why are men wanting to work with rape survivors in a situation where they must know that there is a potential to re-traumatise a victim. If people don't begin to wake up and work out just what is going on, what a terrible state we're in, then I really think there's no hope. Can you still pretend it's none of your business when it's literally people who've been raped? Sometimes young teenage girls who've been raped. Is there a point at which even at risk of your job or your social circle or your media presence, is this the point that you speak?